this opportunity to have some uh, cheddar broccoli instant noodle. I broke down and went down there and got a little wet, got some water. It wasn't the cleanest water either. Kind of riled up. But I need to eat something. Had an early dinner. That was great. The rain is actually getting heavier and uh, it's getting windier. Every once in a while a gust will threaten to shake my tarp off, but it's holding good and it's dry. Spending most of my time maintaining my moats. I have a moat on both sides. At some point I'm going to have to set up the tent. It's only 5 o'clock. There's a couple spots up there that aren't puddles that I might be able to set it up. Or, if I have to, I'll set it up right underneath this tarp and move some of these logs out of the way. But it's getting a little soggy. The view is still awesome though. I've not checked on my fishing pole lately because it's been raining too hard and I don't want to get super soaked. I have two beers. Octopus wants to fight you by Great Lakes. And I was thinking of saving those for Saturday night. But at this point, I'm pretty sure they're going to get drank tonight. Plus, I don't know, I don't have to carry them down the portage truck tomorrow. So, if this is the worst it's going to be, then I'm good. If we get thunderstorms, I'm still good, whatever. I could, I could put the tent right here if I had to. It's not the flattest spot in the world, but... Whatever, I can just sit here under my tarp. Watch the rain. I've set my tent up in the dark enough times where I can do it with my eyes closed if I had to, so I'm not worried about that. Pretty sure I'm not going to put it there now. That was going to be a great spot though. So the plan at this point is for the rain to stop, hopefully soon, and to dry out my clothes tomorrow morning during uh, breakfast, and hopefully push on tomorrow. Um, I probably won't go to White Trout because I'm a day down now, so I'll probably go somewhere else. Sorry, permit office. But. I will, uh, I'm going to do something. I'm not just going to hang out and watch the rain. It's a good chance to, uh, to ch test the gear though. I never did, uh, so my broken bag, but I did find three safety pins in my sewing kit. So if I get bored enough, I can sew that. The problem is I have to take everything out of it to do it. That is not happening at the moment. I'm kinda glad I didn't set the tent up. It only stays dry for so long, you know? If it would slow down for a few minutes, I would go check my uh, my bobber, throw it back out. It's probably like banging up against the side of a rock right now. Okay. Just a quick rainy check-in. I lowered the tarp on this backside because the wind was really coming in 
and my back was getting wet, I, not even from water, just from the moisture. And it quit raining. So I checked my uh, my fishing line, and I'm I'm missing my bait. That's a good sign. And I set up this uh, clothesline underneath the tarp. I've got my my sweats there that got wet. Got them hanging up. I'm thinking they probably will not dry today, but they might get drier. Sorry about the camera work. Yeah set it down. My moats are still running. Um, I walked back into the back of the site to see if I could find um, a better tent pad but it, it's still raining in the in the forest because of the drips so I was getting soaked so I'm gonna chill out for a while. It's just 5 30. Hopefully there's another hour or two of daylight. It's kind of uh, dark and Maybe another round of storms will come through. I don't know. I was wondering if I should try to start a fire, but I don't know. Maybe, maybe not. <laughs> okay, now I'm just doing this because I'm bored. I'm thankful for the tarp. The wind has changed direction. You can see it swirling around out there. On the water. It's kind of coming straight from the south now, it seems like. So one bolt of lightning way behind us. I just saw it flash in my periphery, and we're getting some thunder. It did stop raining for like 15 minutes, and everybody came out of their campsite out by the water. A lot of the people were like laughing and hooting and hollering. And I thought about setting up the tent, but I didn't do it because it was still like dripping like crazy in the forest. So I thought, oh, I'll wait until that stops and then I'll set it up. But it's looking more and more like it's gonna be set up underneath this tarp right here where I'm sitting. And I've slept in worse spots, but it's not very flat, so we will see. It already has a moat though, so that's good. Speaking of which, it's, it's moat maintenance time. maintenance stick. Here we go. Got my moat maintenance stick here. Check the one in the back here. That one's not ready. You gotta keep up on your moat maintenance. I got my um, my tackle box side table here. I mean, I think it's time. There really isn't much else going on. This is a Great Lakes Brewing Octopus Wants to Fight. Another one. The one I had last night was called Life in the Clouds. And it had something to do with Simcoe. It was one of the best beers I've ever had. This is really good though. I could not find the uh, Flying monkey this year, at least not the flavor I wanted. I'll let you know. <laughs> 